Hello, Les from Thailand here and today's video is going to be about can you buy happiness in Thailand? Well, the answer to that is yes you can. Just like buying a car or buying a super duper big TV you'll be happy when you buy these products. And it's the same in Thailand, you come to Thailand you can go to the bars and buy a pretty little thing, beautiful girl and you're going to be happy. But the thing is with buying things the novelty soon wears off afterwards and whether that happiness lasts for a long time or a short time that's up to you um, you can buy happiness you can buy the girl from the bar or you can buy the girl from massage parlor or wherever you pick the girl up and you bought that few minutes of happiness or a few hours of happiness it's up to you whether it goes on or whether it doesn't go on and having a, a partner that you grow together with yeah you might have bought it to start off with but over time that happiness can build and then that happiness goes into a relationship then the relationship goes into a long-term relationship but in the beginning you bought the happiness you bought the person that you want to be with on most occasions I say most occasions because being here for eight years um, majority of people that I've spoken to and, and gone out with and associated with are people who have got divorced in both America and, and England and Australia and then they get to that time of life where there's more to life than working and they want to be happy and they come live over here in, in Thailand or they come for the two week holidays or a month holiday find the Thai girl that they want to be with invariably that's like 10 15 20 years younger than them and then they want to be here they want to stay here all the time because life seems to be better than where they are at present working all the time i live in a beautiful location i'm five minutes drive from the beach a tropical island 20 minutes away i live the ideal life and when people see how i'm living over here this is what they want as well this is what they want to do but you can't do that until you retire and it's only when you retire you can come over to Thailand and actually live that life because the happiness that you bought doesn't last forever because once you go back to Australia or America or England then the problems can start it because you're sending your girlfriend that you fell in love with money every month and you spend two weeks or four weeks with them twice a year it's never going to work the only time you can find true happiness is if you come and live here all the time because then you know what's going on they're with you and you're with them and you can see what's happening but out of the eight years I've been here I've not seen one relationship last by the people working over in another country and sponsoring their girlfriends over here they always get other boyfriends other relationships and it's doomed to failure because they're looking for permanent relationship also you know it, it, it's very difficult to work with them living over here and you living over there it frustrates the people who live in another country because they want to be over here it does get in your head life is much better over here but when you go back to work the realities are your bills, you're living alone and you just want to be over here with your girlfriend. So yes you can buy happiness but you can also buy sadness and it also gets into your head when you're not living here full time. So I would say for those people who's coming over here for the two weeks or three weeks, two or three times a year, buy your happiness for the two or three weeks, go back home, work, come and do it. Don't try to form a relationship with somebody when you're living halfway across the world because it'll end in failure. It'll, it's doomed to end. As the eight years I've been here, I can't count one relationship that's worked like that. They always fail. Um, buying happiness once you come and live over here, it's the same thing. You're going to go pick up the girl that you like and initially you're going to pay for that girl to be with you now sometimes relationships get further on from that because 
you like them, they like you, you sort of click together and you go on from there. Uh, my relationship with, with my wife, um, as I say, we got on well together. Age is just a number, you'll hear that so many times. Well, my wife's 26 years younger than me, but we get on well together. We do everything well together. We've been together nearly four years now, and we have a, a fantastic life. Or I would think it's a fantastic life. Other people might disagree, but I live in a nice house, nice area. I have a brilliant lifestyle, far better here than I could ever have in back in the UK. I couldn't afford this type of lifestyle over in, in England. So money has brought me happiness over here. I don't have a lot of money. There's another video that I've done living on 50,000 baht a month. That's all happiness costs me every month to live in here. 50,000 baht. So have a look at my video. 50,000 baht living in Thailand. Um, it doesn't cost a lot of money. You don't have to have a lot of money. And that takes care of everything. So if you've got any questions, please ask below. I'll answer as soon as I can. Um, so from Les, living the dream in Thailand, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up if you like the video. Thumbs down if you don't. Just leave your comments down below. Until the next time, bye for now.